Hey everyone! In the last video, I replaced the fuel filter on my Audi A6 C5 gasoline engine. Today, I want to cut open this filter to see its condition since I haven't changed it for tens of thousands of miles. Despite the rusty appearance of the filter casing, it seems to bear the name Perflux, which sounds like a good brand. But who knows? Maybe there's nothing inside at all and it's just a counterfeit. Since the filter housing is non-disassemblable, I'm taking an angle grinder and attempting to cut it open to access its contents. Alright, I've finished cutting off the top cover of the filter. See, I've carefully cut around the casing in a circle, and now the top part comes off easily. On this side, the clean fuel goes to the engine injectors. You can tell by the arrow on the casing indicating the fuel direction. Let's try to make another circular cut slightly below this mesh. I've made another cut, and now we can remove the mesh along with the filtering element. As you can see, besides the filtering element, there's nothing else inside the casing. As I understand it, when fuel enters the filter, it first goes into the plastic tube and then starts to fill the entire space around the filtering element. Then the fuel saturates the paper, thereby trapping any dirt particles if present. Next, from the opposite side, the clean fuel passes through the grid into the engine fuel line. From what I can see, the filtering element in my filter doesn't look too dirty for this mileage, meaning I'm using good quality fuel and there are no debris particles in it. Let me try to extract this tube and unwind the filter paper. I've extracted the tube, the filtering element is attached to it, and this is how I've unfolded the paper filter. It formed this tube. So, what can we conclude? This company's filter is good, it contains an adequate amount of filtering material, and the fuel I use for my car is of acceptable quality. That's all for now. Bye.